to the Extra Stream House. I'm here with Lauren Ellis, a photographer painter. Yes. And I tell you, her work is off the hook. I mean, I really love it, and that's why I'm here, because I always bring, you know, artists to the community, let them know that the people out here, they're very talented and got it going on. And uh, it's my pleasure to bring on Lauren Ellis. Thank you. And uh, I got some of the work. Um, while we're talking, we're gonna show some of the work. So just, um, you know, check it out, and. Um, We'll give you more information as we go along how to get in contact with Lauren Ellis. And uh, the work is definitely off the hook. So all you guys out there and young ladies out there want to get some work done, you got to come check Lauren Ellis. Thank yes, you. Yes, photographer, painter, that's off the hook. Well, um, Lauren, how, how long have you been doing this? Well, I finished undergraduate school in 1974, and I've been in my master's in fine art at Florida State University in 1977, so I've been professionally doing this since 1997. I'm sorry, 77. Right. Well, um, so you've, been, you've trained already for this type yes, of thing. Yes, yes. Yeah. Well, I was a painter before I became, became interested in photography. So my medium went from painting to a mixed medium of painting and photography. So I turned my work photographic painting because huh. they're one of a kind and non-reproducible. So um, I turn my work photographic painting and I try to capture the essence and the aura of things happening versus the physicalness. And it's very tricky to do, but um, they're very dreamy and, and surreal. And um, I believe in life that you don't have one perception of something, and that when you dream, you have a multiple of images. Right. And that's how I came about using multiple images in my work. And color is usually, the images are in black and white, and color is used as an emotional effect and I use color to create emotional effects like greens for warm tones, mm -hmm. blue very subtle, reds for when it's fire and advancing and things like that. Beautiful. And you know the thing about um, art today is so many different mediums in terms of art and you I see you created your own. Yes, I did. Thank you. And I'm the only one, I don't want to say the only one, but I'm very few people are working in my medium now because of Photoshop. And people think I did this on computers because that's what's happening today. And I taught at Parsons School of Design for four years. And I taught my style with photo montage, elements of design. Mm -hmm. And I'll be doing a okay. workshop at FIT mm -hmm. this fall. So call FIT Photo Department if you're interested in that. Beautiful. And thank you. And the um, idea is that, like you were saying, most most people don't want to do this, so I'm basically working in a style that's very technically more difficult, mm -hmm. but they are one of a kind. And the things that happen in the dark room when I'm multiple printing that I don't control. And right. I like that, because that's how life is. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, I tell you, it's a beautiful thing to have Lauren Ellis on my show here, so keep it right there. We'll be right back. No doubt, no doubt. Extra strength. One love. <laughs> Welcome back to the Extra Strand House. I'm here with... Lauren Ellis, photographer, painter, and uh, her work is beautiful. You got to check it out. Um, you know, it's, so, it's really nice to have you here on my show. Thanks a lot for inviting me. Uh, without a doubt. And I want to show people the different type of artwork that's out here besides the music and everything. This show is all about unity in our community, bringing all aspects of life together. Exactly. And uh, that's what it's all about, without a doubt. Now, you was telling me about um, 
your other projects that you've done already or you're in the process of doing? Can you yeah. explain that? Sure. Um, the other thing I do is I do portrait fantasies for people and families. Mm. And um, I believe we shot some that I did here of uh, commission work I do. So I photograph people and I do their fantasies, whether my personal self-portrait fantasy deals with ecology and ballet and Egyptian art. Mm -hmm. Those are my fantasies. And then I do different types of people's fantasies, whether it be on a golf course or making love or um, sports or if they want to pretend they're a famous baseball player or something mm -hmm. like that mm -hmm. and also family montage is incorporating their house in the background and the children and the grandparents and I've done some like with three generations of grandparents parents and children and it becomes an heirloom and Beautiful. I do them thank you and I do them in different sizes from 11 by 14 inches mm -hmm. to 40 by 65 inches Beautiful. Well, I know uh, a lot of you out there are watching these paintings, and uh, they're beautiful, and I'm sure you want to get in touch with Lauren. Uh, Thank you. You can call right here. What's the number? Tell them. Uh, my number is 212-946-1160. You make sure you call that number and check out her work. You might want to buy something. You might want to have her to do something for you, you know? You keep it right there, and we'll be right back. This is Extra Strand with Lauren Ellis, photographer, painter, and she's all of that, as you can see. No doubt. Keep it right there. No doubt, no doubt. Welcome to the Extra Strand house. I hope you enjoyed that video. Yo, it's all of that. Well, I'm back here with Lauren Ellis, painter, photographer. She's all of that. And I tell you, you can tell by her work that, you know, she's very creative. So welcome to the Extra Strand house. How you doing, Lauren? Really good, thank you. How you doing, Extra? Uh, Extra's doing fine, especially after visiting your work and checking it out. It's all of that. Thank it you. It just uplifts me and gives me ideas, you know? Oh, that's great. I yeah. love that. I love to be inspiring to people. Well, I can tell that, you know, you inspire people because I'm, I know you're working on um, something now that's very inspiring, not only to uh, the Yankees, but to the Yankee fans, you yes. know? Yes, yes, that's right. I, um, I'm working on some pieces now that um, have just been approved from the um, Baseball Federation of Yankee Pieces. So I have two pieces I uh, have permission to reproduce. So if you're interested in the Yankees, I have original pieces for, you know, a lot more money, and then I have some that are very reasonable and um, reproductions that are very reasonable, and I have the total copyright and the um, rights to the image mm -hmm. and licensing to the image, yes. Well, that, it looks good, and I'm sure a lot of people are going to go out and uh, buy this painting because, you know, it represents the Yankees and the way you do it. It definitely represents the Yankees in a good style and thank fashion. You, thank you, and the history, too. And without thank a doubt. Because when they move, these pieces will even be more valuable because if they should move, this is the original stadium that I, that's in my work and plus Monument Park, and it'll never be the same if they move, so now's the time to get them. That's right. And, you know... For me, you know, I, I enjoy checking out different areas in life in terms of uh, the style of, uh, you know, the way people do things, you know. And I'm meeting Lauren here. It makes me realize there is another style in New York that does exist, and that's the, the style of the artists, the ones who put paintings together, the ones who create art galleries. And, you know, all that life out there is a different life. So all you young people out there, you know, try to check into it and, and keep your eye open for it because, you know, new work is coming uh, about and it's up to you to check it out. You know what I mean? And once you know what it's all about, then you can try to be creative like Lauren Ellis over here and create your own medium in which you can uh, present yourself. Right, and also I work in ecology, mm -hmm. and I'm also going to be a benefit supporting the Guinea Mission at the um, National Arts Club in December, so right. if you're interested in hearing more about that, please call me, and we're going to sell tickets, and it's for the benefit of the Hunger Project, and oh, to help that? people, Beautiful. and um, you know, a lot of people starving around the world that we should help, and I'm going to do it in my way with my art, there you go. donating my percentage of sales. Well, I hope I can help right now, you know, yes, let's help stop are. the hunger, you know what That's I mean? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, yes. Yeah, yes, Without a doubt. Well, um, it's my pleasure to have you on the show here. So, um, folks, keep it right there. This is Lauren Ellis, and my name is Extra Strength, of course, and one love to all of you out there. Keep it right there. No doubt, no doubt. Welcome back to the Extra Strength House. You know, I hope you enjoyed the show. It's all of that. And I'm here right now with Lauren Ellis, a famous uh, painter, photographer, and her work is beautiful. You got to check it out. I hope you've been looking at it and deciding to come check her out because this is what it's all about, you know, 
getting that special painting up on the wall that you can claim for yourself. Because I, I met an art dealer here, an uh, art collector, who got it going on, and he said he only collects it, his work, and he keeps it, and it's his treasure. And I want to give a shout out to him, without a doubt. Julio Polo, big up to you and your Rembrandts, and uh, maybe we'll have him on the show. That'd be great. Yes. That'd be great, without a doubt. Even though he doesn't collect modern art, he thought I was very creative, and he went out of his way to come to my open studio and to look at my work. And yes. He was very interested in supporting me with other um, exhibitions and things. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Now, um, in terms of the music, because I know you do things on the music. I, I, I couldn't wait to get to this because I'm being a you know, recording artist myself. I wanted to you know, uh, ask you some more questions about it. Now, can you explain uh, about the music thing, your music pieces? Oh, Yes, I, um, I've worked in music and dance for a number of years. I have a huge body of work on dance and music. Mm -hmm. And I did a, a poster for Lake Winnipesaukee Music Festival. I did the Joyce Theater Calendar. I did opera postcards. And now I'm into rap and oh, reggae. And I only like to work with the biggest bands. And I do promotional postcards and posters. I photograph them and I create an aura and energy. And I listen to their music a long time so I get a feeling for what they're trying to say. And uh -huh. And then they like it, so it's fun. So you make sure, all you artists out there, you make sure you check Lauren Ellis out and check her work out because it might create a bad album cover that you won't believe, you know, you know what I'm talking about? Sells. Now let me ask you a question. You just won an award in the magazine. Oh yes, yes oh. I did. Thank you for reminding uh, yeah. me. <laughs> Great. What's, what, what is, um, what's the award again? It was the Best Artist. The Timmy Award it's called. It's a wonderful magazine. Pick it up on the newsstand. It's called Talent in Motion Magazine. Mm -hmm. And they write about music musicians and artists and dancers and uh, models and makeup artists. It's all the arts and nightlife. And I was so honored to get the Best Artist Award for the and 1999. And Congratulations. Thank Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks so yes. much. And big up to the publisher of the magazine, Brooke. Ms. Yes, Brooks. Yes, Ms. Brooks. No doubt. And uh, folks, check out that magazine because it's definitely off the hook. Tell me again the name. Talent in Motion magazine, and you can get it on the newsstands. And there's a lovely lady on the cover, and it's a very interesting uh, magazine. Plus, there's poetry and writers in it too. So screenwriters, it's all the arts. And I have never seen a magazine put together like this, especially for New York, which is mm -hmm. so great. It's just so full of all different types of artists. So to get the award of best artist was such an honor. Oh, beautiful! Congratulations. Well, uh, folks, one love and everything is beautiful to have Lauren. Ellis on my show here, and I just want to thank all of you for um, checking the show out, and keep it right there, and make sure you come check her studio out, and call by appointment only, and the number is? 946-1160-212. No doubt. Well, I'm out of here. It's been another beautiful show here. Check you out next week. One love. Let's stop the violence. Big up to James Davis and uh, the Stop the Violence crew, no doubt. That's what it's all about. Keep it real every time. All in your eye. Extra strength. One love. <laughs> That's great.